Hey guys, Tom Peters here, Chapman's Machinery Service. We've got the new 700 Generation 6 here, so come down and have a look at it. Uh, we won't go into too much, I just want to show you some of the new, the new armrest. Uh, the physical appearance is pretty much similar, so we'll just focus on the um, armrest. I think first of all you'll notice that you can have up to six different uh, display units and you can actually change these as well. It's all, it's all touch screen of course. Um, your quick go to button is this button here and that brings up like a quick easy assess so you can go to your, your linkage, your, um, your cruise to speeds and your engine rev speeds. Also um, hydraulics, your headland management system. PDO, it's all self explanatory. Your front linkage, I mean your front suspension, up and down. Um, so I'll go, what I'll do is, I'll, the beauty of the new um, interface is that you can assign this whole armrest. You can assign all these buttons and you can assign these buttons. Um, if you notice that there's red and green, that actually tells you the colour of your remotes. So if I was to change that, so unlock, and I wanted to change this to, um, uh, so I click on here, if I want to change this to green, and you'll, notice, and you'll notice that we've got green, we've got green on our, yep. on our stick, let's, let's just drag, and of course you can have your linkage, click on your linkage, on auto, and it'll come up, and you can, you can place this in any of these. You can also place it on these, on the go and end buttons as well. Um, and also on these buttons as well, and on, on these as well. So if I go across here, we'll get to that in a minute. We can, we can put, we can also assign, yeah, um, yeah, engine revs to this button here, and it comes up here. So you can assign all these buttons as well. Um, also our remote, for your spores, is obviously this is a loader tractor. Um, but as soon as we take this loader off, we can actually assign up to uh, four sets of remotes on this little joystick. So we've got your normal like that. So one and two, and then also this little one up here, which is also a dump and crowd on your loader, and it's also your third function on your loader. When the loader's off, we can actually assign two more remotes on here. So we can have up to four remotes just on this lever stick. Um, also on the interface, you can easily change it so that you can have your, your um, what you want to see on the screen. So if for GPS, for instance, so if we go onto your GPS, um, where are we? We just, all we do is drag across and then all of a sudden, We've got a whole outlay, so if we cross that out, we've got how we want that, and we can have our valves up here. We can have your ISO bus over here, and, and your valves here. Um, so it lets us have a full, um, you can pretty much custom the whole screen how you want. Also, if we click this button here, it allows us to change the dashboard into the into our um, what we want as well. So. There's a whole, um, that's another whole feature there. Um, if we can also get a, another screen here, so you can have your, you can have three, up to three screens, and you can interact between all three of them. Um, which you can have your GPS on here, and your, and have the, also your um, ISO bus on here. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it, I suppose. Uh, what else can we sh show you? Um, no, the mirrors is good. Oh yeah, the mirrors. So that's all from from by sitting in the cab. You can change the mirrors. So you can point up there if you want, and you can adjust them all in the cab. Also on on the screen is your aircon distancing, uh, which is here. You can turn your aircon on. It's all on. It's all on this in the cab, in the cab here. Yeah. Um, what else can we say? So hydraulic spores are here. I'll just turn that, turn that off. So, you can hear us. so if we assign 
I'll just sign these these ones here so you can, um, so if we put that up here back to how it was um, and we go to uh, we go to so over here we want to sign these what these um, spores so if we go click on here and then we'll search so if we create a green oh sorry got to unlock if we create a green one here and all of a sudden it'll, it'll light up green on what on that um, to tell you that it's the green remote yep and you can assign all four of these here's your linkage um, so obviously you, you've got a lock here your locks are here up and down on your rear linkage and you've also got your um, your your remote, yeah, yeah. yeah your depth there, yep, and then on, and then the front ones here as well. It's like your comfort control, like we had in the previous uh, models. Uh, PDOs is obviously you, you're keeping to the same colour coordination like they used to. Is a yellow. Your, your rear one, this one doesn't have front PDO, but it's got a provision there for it. Yep. Um, your your uh, engine rev speeds are here. Uh, your cruise speeds are here, your one and two ranges for your transmissions here, your foot pedal mode, your TMS and your neutralise button. Um, your response is behind here now, so that's, that's there, and that's your normal trigger lever. And you see it's the same remote as your old joystick. Also on the armrest, um, if you lift that up, we've got four USB. You can have four different USB uh, charging your phone, etc there um, obviously these, these levers here so you can still lift up and down and, and slide across that's all you know depends on um, the customer and also here yeah, we've got an isolation button now for the um, for your battery but while it's here you might as well come down and have a look before it's gone it won't, it won't be here for long